The Cardassian Podcast. The Cardassian Podcast. The Cardassian Podcast. Listen if you want to. Okay, everybody, welcome back to the Cardassian Podcast. How are you? Not feeling? sure why you came back, but hey. Oh my God, Courtney. Because we're here. Because, because they enjoy us. Because they enjoy us. Because I don't know why they enjoy checks. you too, but. So you're saying if it was just a podcast of just you, Courtney, that'd be the quietest podcast that's ever. It'd just be called Quiet Time with Courtney. It'd just be called. And she wouldn't. She would hit record and leave the room. It would just be called the water. The water. Plain. Nothing to it. There's it's no just melon. water. There's, There's no, no melon. Anything. There's, There's no, no color. Mm-hmm. I don't need much to pop. Anyway, um, I think uh, everything's been going well with us so far year in this so far. year. Yeah. Um, you know. I have a little bit of a cold, but I'm okay. Um, because You're positive I'm here. about it. Yes. I think the doctor said if you keep a positive attitude, the cold will go away. Right, Chloe? I think you just made that up. I'm maybe I did, I but I'm pretty sure some it a doctor. Bit. Oh my god. Okay, what, Kanye? Is is he your doctor? I'm not answering yes okay. or no. Okay, well, neither am I. Okay, so uh, I guess we should just get straight to a listener response. If that, if you two have nothing else to say, that's important. Everything. Okay, well, listener response. All right. Um, you left these questions on simgmproductions.com where you can leave questions and we can answer them if we think they're watermelon enough. Yeah. Okay. Um, this is from I Kick Strangers interesting name at least i can read it chloe i hope you're not arrested for kicking strangers chloe courtney you said that like you know how to do it without being arrested chloe courtney and kim if you could sing dance or act with real talent okay real talent okay I don't know what that's supposed to say about us. Yeah, I kick exactly. strangers, you're not, but you're don't not, make us kick you. Yeah. I don't think you're reading it correctly. With real talent, would you like to be... Which? What? Or act which real talent would you oh, like? Oh, sorry. I was triggered. I thought that they were coming yeah. for me. Yeah, I, I didn't I was, I, triggered. Was ready to, I was triggered. I had my Twitter out. I was ready to go. Okay, I had booty hole pictures. All right. Or act which real talent would you like to be known for? So if we could sing or dance... Listen, we can do all of these things. So I still feel yeah. a little triggered that you well, think we know Kim can't do no, one of, all can, of these. I actually. can I can sing and dance. Yes, you can, but just not very good. I think anybody no. can do anything. No, you know I think I you, can draw, no, but not yeah, very there's good. a certain level, and you're at zero. I am. If zero is like the highest number you can do, then I'm definitely zero. I think that if. Courtney had it's called raw talent, and that's definitely what I have. Mm-hmm. It's raw. I it's think a raw talent. It honestly, comes straight yeah. from me. First of all, I kick strangers. I'm sorry you didn't get to really get a good demonstration of our abilities because Courtney completely changed we our had theme such song. Such a great song, and I wrote it, and I was really happy. Well, no, about you it. wrote part of it, Chloe. I, I, be- it. I believe it was a hit. So yeah, but you you compl- took you. We, I know we shouldn't. I have made it left better than around. what it was. I it's know we shouldn't it. have left around the digital things that we had recorded. Yeah, no we one were, else was gonna do it. You put Courtney with the laptop in video of us, and it's over. Yeah, I wrote it, and then Kim co-wrote it by adding glow, glow, glow a couple of times. I so it was such. A, you guys have no idea. It was such a good song, and Courtney completely ruined that. Yeah, and I so guess, and now it is the merchandise song. It is now. So but, maybe one day we'll yeah, do like a musical. I don't know, or something like that, and then like you can see our real raw talent. Like, yeah, because our talent, our talent is like it's through the floor. Well, the merch song is epic. You can ask all of our fans. <laughs> Well, they will never know how truly epic yeah, it Yeah, they, have they been. just think that's epic. Okay, so there's our answers. Thank you. Um, Martin Olivia 2007. I guess that's when you made your account. It's 2020. I think they're mistaken. <sighs> okay. Unless that was when they were born. born yeah. Uh, it could be. All right. All right. All sisters. How... Can- Okay, how was your time in Am Famous Make It Stop? I am famous. Um, well, if you well, watch it, all, you'll know that it was kind of, of miserable. First of all, spoilers, if you haven't seen it, go watch it. 
Yeah, if you haven't yeah, watched it, watch turn it. this Please podcast don't. off right now. Spoiler alert, yeah, spoiler. it was a shit show. That's that's no, what I have to say. And I hated it. And we went over this in the last podcast, I think it like a couple of weeks ago. If you or like last say, if you uh watch it, you'll see that Kim failed me and I, uh oh Courtney God. cheated. And but how was your time? Well, cheating is very that's broad. Well, I won't spoil how I believe she cheated. Okay. Um, but I think it was I think some I think of us we did were pretty all, well. When we all like left the jungle, like coming back home in the plane, I'm pretty sure we were all convinced Courtney cheated. Yeah, I believe that. It's just the show was like in favor. You of just her. hate that you didn't win. I mean I was very close. I honestly thought that Rob had a good chance of winning i thought rob had a good chance of winning but he was put up with a task that i don't think any of us could really oh my god completely and i almost dealt with something similar to that and i couldn't i couldn't take it i did a lot sabotage well you gave you quit i mean i mean i mean spoiler alert but i won't tell you why i quit but it was very similar reason as to why rob quit but at least rob tried yeah but i loved your exit it was it was something to admire. So I, I think blacked out. After that was the that. best exit ever. Yeah, it was very good, very I, entertaining. Mom, com- I think mom wanted that to happen. I I don't know. I about think that, we Kim. all wanted it to. We're happen. her I money maker. We're her money. We make like we make money in this family. I, I completely don't think completely blacked out, and I it took them. Do it didn't know? sound like you blacked out. It sounded like you were very. Where did, where did you land? When I, you when you get so high, there's a point where your like oxygen stops working. And I did you go out. to the uh, all you? I know is that it got very dark at one point. Did you see any stars? And I don't mean like stars in your like, I, I'm telling I literally saw like the did curve. you lose gravity for a second? Did you see yay? I saw yay because my life flashed before my eyes and that's my life. But I saw the curve of the earth. Like all I know is that the sky went from blue and clouds to suddenly like a uh, little bit of black, and then Pam. I blacked out. I thought I went it high with that pterodactyl. It took two days to find me. And oh. by then, the show was done shooting. Wait, where did you land? That's I what like I want to know. on the other side of the island. Oh, my God. And they were like, oh, we didn't have the map for it. You're lucky with how high you went that you landed at least near the vicinity. Yeah, you landed we right back in the same spot. I mean, on the other side, it was a pretty big island. But still, like, you're lucky you didn't land in like Am a different... Am I lucky? Uh, yeah, listen... You we thank goodness I we have these astronaut ashes. You were for okay. One second. You could have landed in the ocean. Yeah, that you would were have okay. been great. I think I would have been. Either way, when I came back, cold and scared and alone, Welcome Courtney to my was world. laughing. Wow, it was I a peaceful two days. I'll tell you that. So in all, it was a great experience. Um, it was an okay experience. Yeah, I don't recommend it. I didn't like landing in the my water. My time was fabulous. Yeah. To answer your yes, question. Somebody had a good time. Of course it was. Okay. Uh time for the next question. Uh Zara Waters 4. Hey, this comment is for Courtney. Since you are the better sister and the oldest, whatever, can yeah. you please share some of your wisdom and tell me the best thing to know while growing up? Oh God. Also, you don't Kim, need to read the next part of this. Also, Cam, orange soda has been proven to cause more spots and wrinkles, and strawberry soda is much more healthy. I'd like to know where you got your statisticals because that is in no way accurate. Cam, or is Cam. very accurate. Let Zara speak their truth, and let's orange let let has... this question is for Courtney. So, Zara, Courtney, Zara. how do you deal with growing up? Zara Waters wants my wisdom. Sure. Yeah, what little Just there is, they want say to say whatever you're going to say. I say, follow your heart. Ignore everyone else. Oh, please. And stay on your own path. Well, you're good at, at, at you know, at ignoring everybody at one else. one of those you're definitely good at. Just, I will say you do follow your own path. I would say just be, just be very self-centered and... Oh, g- great advice. Yeah, great. Listen, I mean, we're all successful in some way, so I guess we can all give tips, but I'm but this question's they, for Courtney. It wasn't for us, though, and you will yeah, go on forever, They don't want to hear Chloe. from you. Well, you'll go on forever about how great Ord Soda is, even though Zara just proved that that's incorrect. No, that's Zara's. So I guess we'll move on since you can go that. on, Cam. All right. Um, I love you and respect you. 
Zara Waters. Okay. Four. Thank Zara, you're so watermelon. Oh, whatever. Not really. Um, Tom Stud23. Stud? <clears throat> whatever. Uh, to Chloe, I mean, hi. Um, wow, so now your you... voice changed suddenly to a lot more affectionate after you found out it's for you. Stop. I your voice Todd. changes all the time, Kim. Shut up. I do not change my voice. Like, what are you guys Tom hearing? Tom Stud. Okay. Who's, what? To Chloe. If you are the true fighter and survivor, then how come Courtney stayed in the jungle for the longest? Also, to wow. all the sisters. You take back question. the way you started that question, also, Chloe. You don't like Todd. Tom, sisters, do you? Shut up. Kiss, marry or kill. I hate this game. Claire from Jurassic World, Taylor Swift, or Lana Del Rey. Ooh, okay, this, we'll answer that good. after. Now, to answer your question, as a true fighter and survivor, as you say, true, I know when it's time to, you know, see what things oh, are. Well, they're I look quite, at my surroundings. They're, and I know when I'm been, getting cheated. And I know when my sister's cheating. What a cop well, They're so, questioning whether you're the true fighter or survivor. Yeah, they're I They're basically am. calling me the true fighter no, they're and survivor. Saying, it does kind of sound no, like No, you two already me. made sure that you, you've you already oh said that I'm God. the true fighter and survivor. I already so, said we, I retract that. You can retract all you want, but it's in the archive. You know what I'm saying? We took it and back, so Chloe. many of our listeners have said this besides Todd. Uh, Whatever your name is, Tom. Um, Todd. Whatever. It's no. It's Tom. You stupid bitch. Oh, it's yeah. Tom's dad. The other part has whatever. Um, I am the true fighter and survivor. Let's get it very clear. Courtney is the cheat, and um, who cares how she said the longest? What if you, know you have to cheat to be a survivor? Then you're not a-, a true. Maybe maybe Courtney is a fighter and survivor in some way, but she's not a true. But there's only fighter one true fighter and survivor in that's the whole right. world that's right okay mm-hmm. so you can't cheat bear some grills has nothing on me okay um now kiss marry or kill okay um let's see here mm. um well kill- i would kiss lana because she spent a lot of money on those lips and we don't want to go to the race i and would you? i would um i'd probably marry taylor because she's talented oh, and loaded and claire can choke because she freaking like made us say everything safe everything yeah, fine she did lie. and she put us she she got us in the biggest trouble so that's my answer i would probably well i would kill taylor um but not wow. not because of any personal feelings just for this game because you don't want to get bit by a snake and then i would marry lana i guess okay but it would be like a quick divorce okay and then i would kiss claire but i would like shove her to the dinosaurs oh wow okay, okay. so really i killed everyone. there's no I way like, for claire to kiss and tell after that okay yeah that's very true were you just saying did you just want to get a pun in there oh we're not known to do puns around here i kind of agree with chloe okay um. Yeah, I guess I would kiss Lana. Yeah, I guess I would kiss Lana because she is hot. Mm-hmm. And then I would marry Taylor just to welcome her to the family mm-hmm. and annoy Kim. Mm-hmm. That would be awesome. You're making a huge mistake. Even in even so, though we would both is... be married to her. How did that make you feel, Kim? I feel betrayed because why would you do that to me? I love it. And then I'll kill Claire because, yeah, she was a dumb bitch and got you us. You killed Claire because she was about to kill us. Yeah, basically. I mean, well, yeah, when you think about it. Yeah. Okay, but you want to kiss her and then shove her. We kill her either way because I had no choice. Okay. Love you, Claire. Hmm. All right. Um. Next and last question. Uh. I th- what is that? Kill or kneel? I, I kill. K- kill with her le- with her lemon to come. Is that like a withering watermelon? Listen up, this is for you. To count. Is it normal to have red, itchy rashes right after using glow, glow, glow? Yes. Yes, I can answer that for you. Uh, But no, uh, this is my question. The question's not done. I washed my face right after using it because I felt a burning sensation on my face, but then it left some red patches on my face. Uh, Oh, you can Google this. It's everywhere, honey. Um, Also, would you be giving out PR packages and would you send one to Taylor? Kim? 
You can give your answer and then me and Courtney will give the real No, answer. here's the thing. You use glow, glow, glow as instructed, mm-hmm. which is what Keel did. And then, yes, there is redness left over, but you're supposed to let it peel. Mm. Is there slight bleeding? Might, might You might have a little diarrhea, but that doesn't mean it's not working. That it's means the product. It's, it's you have to, you up. You mm-hmm. have to stick with it, and then you would have skin and a good lifestyle like me. And the, no, Taylor's not getting a package because she doesn't deserve one. I think you should give her a package. No, no. No, I'm not giving her the best it would product. Be the, my it wife would be to the, be alone. I'm not giving her the best product. On I'd Earth. say it'd be the ultimate revenge. You'd mess up her skin. How? By giving her something magical and powerful? Oh, it's powerful, all right. Is that, is that what we're calling it now? Is That's that what we're what calling the chemicals do. Is that what we're calling f***ed up chemical peels now, Cam? Is that what we're calling it? It's better than a chemical peel because it comes from within. Okay, so the real answer is, if you really want to know why this is happening to you, Google it and look up Glow, 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 bankruptcy. And you'll see a whole bunch of lawsuits and a whole other people who are going Those through what are you're going who through. Don't, who were not Cam, following. I'm trying to save their skin. They were not following the instructions as written. It sounds like Wither Lemon is asking for an apology. Also. They're not getting one because they're, they're going to be thanking me and apologizing to me once they have clear. Wait, and wait happy. a minute. Do you guys smell the. I smell a lawsuit. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I have a little note here. It's from it's from uh, the lawyer. Um, have you or a loved one been affected by glow, glow, glow? You'll be seeing something like that on the uh, TV soon. Dang. If you get a letter like that, it that's a phishing scam. It's a money scam because you will get some money. Cause... Listen, There's... glow, glow, glow needs to revamp and do something different, okay? The Cardassian Podcast is brought to you by Gizmo Grind. Gizmo Grind makes selling your used smartphones and other tech simple. Instead of trading it in for store credit, a Gizmo Grind trade gets you paid with your choice of check, Zelle, or PayPal, and it's all done online. Start by visiting the site and getting an instant quote. Print out the prepaid label and drop it off at your local CVS or USPS office. By visiting gizmogrind.com slash the Cardassian podcast, listeners of this podcast can receive an additional $10 bonus if you trade in your device today. That's G-I-Z-M-O-G-R-I-N-D dot com slash the Cardassian podcast. That's so, that's so, that's so watermelon. So watermelon. watermelon. All right. It's time for that so watermelon where we take five random topics and we decide if they are so watermelon or so not watermelon. Come. And yeah, we're going to listen to Kim talk not I'm in, in her my voice. regular voice. Thank you very much. Booty hole pictures. So watermelon or so not watermelon? So not watermelon because I'm so sick of Chloe always threatening them. They are she, so not watermelon. I have yet to see them. They're so not. Really, Chloe? Booty hole pictures are not so watermelon. Do you think I enjoy? I'm shocked. Do you think I enjoy I putting do. out booty hole pictures? I yes. Do you think Chloe. I enjoy hiring people to get these booty hole pictures? Yes. You think I enjoy Chloe. this? I don't like booty hole pictures. Who wants to look at a booty hole? I do what I have to do You're for this family. to be specific. Specifically, that is, I don't know where you got it from, but. Kem? Yeah. And Kem. how do you know whose booty hole pictures you don't, they are? Listen, she if doesn't. you knew what I had to do to make this family keep going, I have to do so much. Do you think we would have a podcast? Do you think this would be a thing if I didn't have booty hole pictures? Oh, yes. We thank you so much, Chloe, for you, your booty hole pictures. Well, you don't know what you're day. thanking me for, Kem. You honestly don't. Oh, so they are not watermelon. So I don't enjoy doing this. Yes, I don't but like you it. use them for your benefit. I do use them for my benefit. So you I should say they're to. watermelon. They're not watermelon. I don't like them, but they get the job done. Anytime I see Chloe with her phone and I hear, well, got another one. I know what she just did. It's not always that. Sometimes it's just another person suing glow, glow, glow. And I say, oh, you got another one. But sometimes, yes. I do well, get that person a, is most likely Taylor just doing it anonymously. And I have to no, it's not Taylor. I'm pretty sure. It's not. Um, but you what you what you two don't know won't hurt you. And they're not watermelon kids. Don't threaten well, booty yes, hole of pictures. Of course they're so not watermelon. But this family has to run somehow. 
Got to keep food on the I, table, Kim. I guess we answered the question. Yeah. So well, they're, wasn't, they're not that watermelon. Was not a question. It was just, is it so watermelon? It's so not watermelon. And it's so not watermelon. Yeah. And my answer to the question is. They it's aren't. not a question. It's, so it's not a watermelon. topic. Okay. Next topic. Royalty. So watermelon or so not watermelon? You mean like royalties? Like getting royalties, like some money for something? No, I think, or it just means, like, I think it means like. Prince Sim Charles. Yeah. Well, people say we're the royalty of America, but yeah. I don't know about that. I don't really, I don't associate myself with royalty. I think royalty, they have to, a lot of standards or whatever to live up to. I do. I think I'm a queen. Well, I would say it's more so me and Kanye, king and queen. Of what? Of television and the and youtube and okay the world when you really like really think about it okay yay dumb i thought about it i did it's agree. a yay dumb yeah i don't think you know i'm gonna say royalty is so not watermelon like no disrespect to actual royalty in the world but i think because people, they will be listening so i think just- people use that term of like king queen queen of this king of that too much and it makes it causes division. And um, yeah, so, so not watermelon. And that's your actual royalty. Well, I think it's a compliment when someone's like, yes, queen. Yeah, yeah that's so- great. But I mean, like people like say like, no, she's the queen. No, she's do, the queen. Do people say yes, king? It doesn't sound right. I think they do. But it's like not the same. Yeah. I think there's like different levels of royalty. There's like social royalty. Yeah. And then there's like actual Lunds royalty him, like where they do yeah actual like queen stuff crowning and princesses and stuff. yeah so i don't know i just feel like there's a lot of pressure in that and there's a lot we don't know but i i agree with social royalty yeah i guess yeah so it's so watermelon yeah it's so water it depends but it's so watermelon i think yeah i mean it has its ups and downs so maybe maybe it is a little watermelon i don't know but like not a fully developed watermelon you know what i'm saying no well, right. that's because you're not royalty. Next topic, Sim Disney movies. So watermelon or so not watermelon? I like it if they can give me a rated R movie at some point. Chloe. No, I'm just saying I really like some Disney movies. I do. Like, they're really fun. They own everything. Um, yeah. But I think that if, like, if I want them so to be a little want, bit more daring. So I want you want them, them to be, to be more, more gritty. More gritty, a little bit more daring about things. What kind of thing do you like picture Sim Disney doing then? Yeah. I don't know. Just like being a little bit more, I don't know, having a little bit more div- d- diversity, um, having some rated R movies. Uh, so you basically sh- not just, being afraid to show some blood. You know what I'm saying? So all you, these you, want, you want some violence. All these hero movies. And explosions. All these hero movies, people are getting... You thrown across this and that, and they just get a little scar on their face. Come yeah. on! So you want more blood? Yeah, there was a more time where explosions, Sim, more titties. There was a time where Sim Disney had a little bit more darker tone to what they did. Now it's all pretty much like here's this, here's that, here's this. It works. There you go. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Give me some blood. Yeah, I don't know if they're gonna go that far. It is so watermelon. They I will say that. They magically bleed from their mouth. It is so watermelon, is but it just needs yeah. more. Come on, like. I don't know because sometimes I want to sit. I think there's studios for that, and then there's studios that like provide magic. Yeah, but like when they own everything at some point, like give me some, you know, titties. Yeah, I don't titties. know about nudity. I don't know if about nudity. Oh, so you're nudity. fine with blood, but you're afraid of titties, no, Chloe? No, no, okay. that's not what I'm saying. I'm you saying heard it like, here first. Uh, gritty doesn't mean like having like sex and stuff like that. That's not what I'm talking about. Like, no, I, know I that didn't say sex. I just said some nudity. Oh, that's what it means to me. Oh, okay. Well, but like, from what I understand, they're going to be doing some more like horror movies and stuff like that. Like, give me something, you know. You just want more. I guess you'll have to wait for it. Is Bambi losing his mother dark? Yes. Should we see it happen? Is that what you're saying? You want to no. see the actual No, I'm just saying just be more realistic. It. If you get punched and stuff, you're going to get some bruises. I think Sim Disney is already dark enough because they already have parents that are dead or just aren't there. Yeah, I had But we didn't that. see it happen. And we don't have to see it happen. That's not what I'm saying. The what tones if, are what dark. What if Nemo had been like, we saw the mother get chopped to pieces or something? No. Then the blood in then Nemo's like, no, as... His I think she got. I think red. she got eaten. That is not what I am saying. I'm not. You're saying, saying more grittiness. Yeah, more grittiness. But like, if it's PG thirteen, like, like dark, push sad on right that now, thirteen. But let's get dark. 
bloody. If it's PG-13, I'm saying it's push a little bit more on the 13 and above. You know, 13 to 17, we can take it a little bit more. You don't have to curse every two seconds or whatever. But, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't have to be gory. Okay, some Disney you heard at first. Some Disney. We have some, we have we some need, ideas. We need titties and dicks. That's not... That's not what explosions and blood, too. Yeah, but you have some good ideas. Not Chloe, gory, I think they not can gory, not gory. That's not what I'm saying. You just said you want that. I didn't say to split Nemo in two. You crazy bitch. Not I'm just him, talk- his mother. Okay, okay. He already has the muscle. Moving on, phone. moving on. And then it's like so a, watermelon. A piece of her fin floats by. It's so watermelon, but just. Amp it up a little bit. It's so watermelon. I'm fine with the yeah. way it is. I do like how it is. So watermelon. Okay. Next topic. Crocodiles. So watermelon or so not watermelon? So not watermelon. I, I think, don't know what a crocodile is. I think they're dangerous because they can swallow time. I know I'm going to make somebody in Sim Florida mad when I say this, but I don't know the difference between a crocodile and an alligator. Yeah. I know. I, think, I know what an alligator is. I think a crocodile has. I'm pretty sure the difference is that one of them swallows time and the other one doesn't. Like in some Disney, which yeah. one? Oh yeah, but they that's do that in real life. They swallow watches and clocks. Okay, but which one swallows it's what they time? Eat. Is crocodiles? One, is one in the ocean and one in the lake? Swamp. Listen, I think that it would make it unsafe for people, if you choose to, to swim in just like any lake that you want, like a swamp or whatever. So, yeah, I think that's the major difference is that one swallows clocks and that's like what they eat primarily. That's what they eat. And okay. then the alligators eat other things. I think that they could be really disruptive to the environment, even though they may help by eating some things. Um, so um, I, th- I think they're still not watermelon. They yeah, so out. not watermelon. Yeah, they're still not watermelon. I don't so understand like- what they do. They eat clocks. Oh, God. Can we please just... Next topic. I... Puppets. So watermelon or so not watermelon? Mm, I think so watermelon. I th- I've seen some really fun movies and stuff with puppets. And I think puppets helped lend to things like stop animation. And animation of like, like, like what we are. If there was anything to be possessed, that's the first thing getting possessed is a puppet. Okay, if we're talking about possession. Yeah. I think that That'd like be cool. they're the easiest thing to it's like think about it the spirit is like let me go into that puppet because it has moving arms I can move how I want to speaking of them Pinocchio was possessed nobody talks about that uh, well he just wanted to be a real boy Ken. he was possessed I know that possessed he was. by an evil boy the original possessed yeah yeah but I think that meanwhile uh, you had kids turning into donkeys I honestly don't think we would exist had it not been for uh, puppets. Because that's like the beginning of animation of something that isn't like yourself. You know what I'm saying? I think think it lends to it. I think drawing is the first animation. Yeah, there was drawing. But in terms of like thinking outside of different mediums, 3D mediums. You know what I'm saying? So robots. Yeah. Robots. I'm pretty sure puppets came before. I'm pretty sure robots came before puppets. Fine. Then it's the precursor to robots, not drawing. Okay, Puppets well, don't cuss. So. We're not drawings. Okay. We're 3D animations. Yeah. Okay. So um, that's We're a my, higher technology so, than puppets. Yeah, robots. we are. But you have to start somewhere. Okay. Um, I think cool. a Courtney puppet would be great. I think a Courtney puppet would be so annoying. I think we're looking at a Courtney puppet. Yeah. I think we're all puppets. Yeah. That's mom, what I'm really, trying to say. About it. We're all puppets in some way. You know what I'm saying? That is not what you were trying to say, but thanks for jumping on my no, opinion. No, Robots was your opinion, you stupid bitch. Because they be they came before puppets. They are so watermelon unless they're possessed. I guess they're watermelon. I'm kind of on the fence they're about so those. They're so not watermelon. Fine, whatever. All right, segment three. Who's the smartest? This is when we're given three random words we don't know, and we try to guess what they mean. Whoever guesses the closest is the smartest. You guys ready? No. Wow. Just being honest. First word. Vitiligenous. Spell it. Or vitiligenous. V-I-T-E-L-L-I-G-E-N-O-U-S. I think 
Vitiligo. That has something to do. That sounds like the study of something. And I think it's like the study of something that has to do with, um, I don't know. I'm trying to break down this word, but I don't know how to break it. Down. That sounds like an it's expert original. of something that starts with a V, but I don't know what that like vitals intelligence. To me, I think it's a specific study, a study of something, but I, I don't know what. I think it's an expert of something. Courtney. Unlike vitals or something. Courtney, what do you think it is? I don't know. Someone, I don't, maybe someone who's like very vigilant and is good at looking at details of something. Well, that's I, actually the, I mean, I'm not going to your... That's kind of what I said. Well, I said an expert in something. And so you're saying somebody who is vil- who, vigilant. Who's vigilant. Yeah. I was trying to think of what word reminded me of that. And it was probably that, but. I won't take it. Um, but Wait, I don't what know. was your answer? Mine's like to st- the study of something, like the studying okay. of something. I don't know what. I don't know <laughs> the study of vigilance. I don't know. Study of something, expert on something, somebody who's vigilant. Yeah. It says cells in the ovaries which supply nutriment to the developing <gasps> ova. I of, was kidding. Of many insects. Okay. So you guys aren't going to believe. Wow. You guys aren't going to believe me, but I did think vagina but i didn't want to say because i thought it would but make me sound stupid it, i didn't say it but i thought it would make me sound stupid. it has something to do with the reproductive but, yeah yeah vitelligenous cells okay wow wow i was actually i i wanted to say vagina but you know I well, it has be to inappropriate. Be sort of. you were saying it as a joke but i'll give you half a point no I, okay. no because she, she this, didn't, this, this is my category she didn't Say you it saw was the a, motion that I did when we were talking about this. I cow. did. This is my segment. So she when the word was said, I spread my legs oh my as God. a joke. Okay. So okay. so she's gonna be half a point. It's the study Not of the fair, it's the study whatever. of the vagina. It is the study. Not really. Of it's just the, the growth of You said something. ovaries. The growth of a yoke. Okay, so okay. I got half a point. Yeah, okay, we'll give you half a point, whatever. I didn't know that my jokey mind was actually okay. Okay, next word. A gossary. Spell it. The study of the month of August. It's A-G-A-C-E-R-I-E. A gossary. Maybe that means like another word for like absurd. You are so a gossary. I think it's like a like, guest. I think it's an upset stomach. Uh, I've got a gastery. It does sound like it's a flu season. I have a gastery. Take some tums for that a gastery. Maybe it's some kind of plant, like cells in a plant. A gastery. That's definitely your go-to. What plants? plants. But well, there are a listen, lot of plants out there. She's one in the past. Yeah, I know. I think it has something to do with like a stomach, your upset stomach or something. Stop being a gut strain. If you can remember what a gossary, I thought it was a gossary. Shut up. It means allurement, enticement, enchantment. So basically seducing somebody. So Kim is still a gossary. No. Yes. No. It doesn't, I think that's a good example. It doesn't sound sexy. I'll tell it's you. It's similar that. to no. what I said. Stop being a gastry. No, you said absurd. Stop that's being so flirty. The opposite. With me, Kim. That is basically the opposite. So You're I was, being absurd in flirty. So gastry. So I get a point. No, I'm kidding. No. I'm kidding. No. Nobody has a point. That is the least sexy word for such a sexy word. It's supposed to be a sexy just word. Just say flirty for Christ's yeah. sake. Okay. Like, baby, you're so a gossary. What did you call me? That's like, that's, that I would be find my you a That doesn't get me in the mood. Sorry. No. Last word. Soft. What? Like, you too soft. How many times do I have to tell you to spell it, Courtney? You don't have to tell me. I know to spell it. How do you spell it? Is it like how I think it is or it's not? Probably it's not. It's S-A-U-F. S-A-U-F. Are you soft. sure it's not like South or South? I don't care what it, I want to say South. Because there's S-O-F-T. We all know what that yes. is. But like South. Is, I think that's like South. Like South. I think I've south. heard, I think I've that, heard that word. like something that comes off of your soap. Like I've got South on me. Yeah. 
I'm not actually. Yeah, it does kind of sound like something for like suds, like suds yeah, from bubbles. Yeah, like some sort of. It's like the residue. Yeah, I think like it's sa- some kind of clothing material. I like, it's I'm, made out of soft. So I actually agree with Kim on this. I think it has something to do Wait, with like. What was you? Okay, so you said clothing, right, Courtney? You said clothing. Yeah, some kind Type of, clothing. of like clothing material. Like, and I think it is something that is actually silk. kind of like relates to like bubbles or like from... So you're taking my answer. No, I said I agreed with you. So we're both... What, yeah, are we going to share a point if we get yeah, it? Yeah, that we, it's not like that hasn't happened. Oh, God. For, oh, so sorry. I agree with you, Kim. I'm sorry that you're stealing. I'm not stealing anything. This yeah. is absolute form of save. But obsolete form of save. I don't know what that means. So it literally means except for. Except excluding. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so it means except. It means to accept. Can you say that for like a dinner order then? I'll have meat and potatoes. Everyone. No, I'll have a burger. I'll have Seth, a... Everybody... Burger, I'll have a soft, cheeseburger, Seth. Seth the cheese. Yeah. Uh, everybody in this room, Seth. I, I feel I it doesn't even feel right coming out of my Seth, mouth. Chloe. Everybody in this room is beautiful. Seth, Kim, and Courtney. Is that how? Oh, just wow. an example. That's just an example. Yeah. No, I don't think it works. It's that just way. an example. All right, that does it for the third segment. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you, everybody. Ew, that means Chloe won. Yeah, I won by half a point. Half the point. first win of the year. And that was an accident, like. To be honest, yeah, I kind of gave that to you. Yeah, if there's that anything was kind we, of a pity. Half if there's point. anything that we learned today, it's to go with your gut, even if it sounds ridiculous. Well, thank you everybody for listening. I hope you had a good time. Are and you eating? Are you driving? Are you sleeping? You're not about to take. Well, you know, what? actually, I'm glad it's catching on. No, it's I'm glad not it's catching, catching on. on. It's just like me mocking. being a fighter and survivor. Like you oh just keep doing it, god. and people accept it. Oh my god, um, a true fighter and survivor. Um, Don't forget to look out for our third podcast coming out next week. Well, yeah. Third podcast of the month. It's yes. for bloopers. Keep an eye out for that with bloopers and outtakes and stuff Check like that. Check out our merch. Go to simgmproductions.com for all things SimGM. Also, if you want to leave a question for the podcast, go to that same website, simgmproductions.com slash podcast, and you can leave a question. Okay. Um, mm-hmm. But I think that's it. Are you eating? Are you drinking? Are you walking? Just it did doesn't that. matter that you I just I think did it's that. better when we all say one thing. It well, seemed to flow. You may think it's better, but... She doesn't like gelling and flowing. Well, though. you had to let me know when you guys are going to accept it was that happen- I have It was happening naturally. naturally. You have to accept that I have the superior ideas and then let me know so we can include okay, it Okay, thank you in so my much podcast. for listening to our podcast, thank the Kardashian so Podcast. Thank you so much. Thank Courtney. you. S- Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye.